This could be discussion. I don't need skills. I need towers. <laughs> Welcome to Team VR Over Game Podcast thing. And welcome to the Cowboy for Game Yu-Gi-Oh! podcast. I'm your host, Jake. Tonight, I'm joined by Ben from Nolan TCG. Hello. And Blake from Blake Goes Face. How was our week in Yu-Gi-Oh? Uh, we'll start with Blake. Um, it was fine. I went X1 again. Not today. Not, not Sunday, the last one. Oh, no. We would have discussed that yes. on the last yes. podcast. Um, so but, from uh, the yeah. of things you've done, nothing. Um, no, only on Saturday I did um, Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff and then tried to ignore the magic stuff that I had to do. Um, but it was good. Um, I did some... Randomly did some, like, tutorial gameplay stuff with, like, the new people because they came in on... Um, uh, yeah, and I was like, oh, I'll do some, like, games and stuff. But I think one of them went X1 tonight. So yes, she I, said. She I messaged intend me. to and bring that up Zeus. in my part. And then pulled Zeus. Well, it's too late. Yeah. Then pulled a Zeus. Yes. yes. Good work, Myra. I'm Hell yeah. You. Well done. I'm um, playing... I know you're Should, should I? I think so. No, they do! No, no, I, no. Dragon no. Oh, dra- oh, yes, Dragon oh, Maid. Right, yes, Dragon yes, 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 yes. Oh, that's why you wanted to bring it up. That's why I couldn't be proud of. I got asked multiple times, oh, can you check deck list? And I was like, for Dragon Maid? Just pen. I was like, I guarantee you. I was asked at the start of the night. Pretty solid list. Cool. Um, yeah, I, there was, unfortunately, it was like, even with Shadows and stuff like this, I could kind of go, oh, okay, this is about right. We can put together a little bit of a side deck. They they go, oh, can you look at Dragon Man? I went, I've never played this. I don't know what any of this does. I'm yeah, sorry. You play the engine and you play Hindrips. <laughs> yeah, fair. Um, but no, other than that, you've just Dylan, described every oh, deck list for the past I, uh, five years. I downloaded. <laughs> I downloaded Master Duel. Um, I re- sorry, re-downloaded Master Duel. Why'd you delete it? Need the I'm, space for more, I don't know, free shooters. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm going to be honest. I just didn't like... Uh, no, it came up as an update, and I was like, no, go away, bin. Um, you're not letting me summon birds, bin. Um, so yeah. Uh, but I re-downloaded it, get, I had a couple of games um, playing whatever the hell I had built. Oh, I have Cleese built on there, because it's fine. Um, is fine, isn't amazing, but gets wins. Uh, you know, I wish good. I wish there was messages so I could cop some abuse for what I did to some people, but you know, it's unfortunate. Ben, how was your week? My week was surprisingly good. I decided to switch to Paleo for the little bit of stretch mm-hmm. and stretch until we get branded, because still don't have it. Still hasn't arrived. Well, te- well, kind of. It is available, but not here. So the, some places got it last Friday, the other places, like us, don't have it yet. We're, fingers crossed, have it tomorrow, it left Melbourne today, um, so hopefully it gets delivered tomorrow. We'll figure that out when we figure it out in this truck. Shut that, up! That's the truck! That's We're the truck. doing that's a podcast! Yeah, that's we are doing truck. a podcast! That's the truck Do you know who we are? Branded on it. Oh, yes. Wait, or do you reckon it's the truck from the bread factory? No, yes. Mm. Or the toast factory. No, because it goes from the bread to the toast factory, then it leaves. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I continue. <laughs> so, played Paleo. Uh, I won Sunday Locals. Hell yeah. You quite, did. Quite happy to do that with, with Paleo. Um, is it just... Um, is it the Paleo I would know? It's like a bunch of traps, frogs. Yep. Make, Pretty much. Uh, make it is, frog. It is DPE in your yeah, side, it you? is that with DPE. Cool. Uh, DPE in that deck, very good. Um, yeah. Like, in the decks where I... Because I played Gozen in the main, and I was worried that it would conflict with Scapegoat, DP, like, Paleo Frog stuff as well. Didn't com- didn't conflict at all. Um, like, whenever I flipped the Gozen, I was typically only just had the DP on board anyway. And, like, cool. and then I was just, like, being oppressive with the DP. It yeah. saved me a lot. Like, tonight, against Myra in game two, uh, I effectively just locked her under Gozen because I knew that Dragon made... Like, I know Dragon Maid inside and out enough to just be able to easily interact with that deck with a Gozen and a DP just, like, popping Go when I need to pop. Get there was one interaction that she missed that we went through after the game where it was, like, I end of main phase, DP popped a maid, uh, popped a maid, but she had a live tidying in Graveyard, so she could have brought another one back and then started battle phase tagged and then gotten over the DP. That would have caused some problems, but... Yeah, we were still... It was still fine. Um, yeah, worked really well. That was tonight. Tonight I went X1. Um, but yeah, won locals on Sunday. Really happy. I was super stressed whenever I play Paleo that I'm going to lose in time. Because, like, the last time I played Paleo, 
all my losses were losses in time where I was in full control, and it's like, I've just taken Was a that because damage. you had taken damage and were playing, or was that because you, like, anaconded? No, no, no. It's no. mainly so, because Paleos aren't particularly oppressive in terms of their attack and defense, so someone can just poke over, yeah. like, a monster and you've you lost take by a bit of life points. poke damage, and then you're trying to out their board whilst building your own, and yeah. you will eventually get there, but. In the meantime, you've taken damage. Thus Might be the closest to... thing, actually, I've heard to control. For the to circle back on that conversation, yeah, we had. Is that, that is a is. very con- that is a control. very Paleo's. control gameplay. Like, yeah. hence why I chose it as my favorite control deck. <laughs> yeah, when we did that, we um, that question. Yeah, really cool. But, um, also, frogs. That's that's interesting. We like uh, we like some frogs. We're looking forward yes. to frogs. Maybe. Uh, the end of this year we no <laughs> I'm looking forward to some frogs Jake's gonna love it when I'm like oh yes I'm resolving my swap frog he'll be like oh you are yes yes your Oshtosh Frosh your exchange of the frog I, I think the ghost frog is actually very good against that um what does it not that deck not swap frog but that deck oh that deck. apparently um, ogring a specific point of it means it won't resolve and they don't get to summon the swap I'm, yeah I'm fairly sure I think the XCs, if they activate the effect and you over it, it's good because then you're not floodgated. Yeah, and your Gamma and Nibiru are not dead. Yeah. Can't that's so... Sh- spiel. That's really weird. Spite. Anyway, we'll talk about that later. You can play the Oshtokosh with the Splite. Yeah. Uh, my week. Um, so, I went in Sunday. It was a very small locals. Uh, my hands were atrocious and I think I ended up going X1... Yeah, but like one of them was a buy, so it was like, yeah, it was Hell nothing yeah. out there. The Pretty sooner much. I got out of there, the better. It was all a bunch of Final Fantasy people, and they're oh, obnoxiously loud. Like that. Final Fantasy people are so fucking obnoxious. Like, if you play Final Fantasy and you're a quiet person, like, yeah, cool, be a chill dude. But like, the regionals that was at our locals that day was fucking horrible. The they people sucked. So oh my goodness, loud. sorry, I didn't realize because um, I ran one on Saturday. It was a two day thing because yeah. it's two different formats. Damn, um, I, how do they so have two different formats in Final I Fantasy? Won't, I won't lie. One like, format is shit enough. Even even um, Myra and stuff. Who, for Myra and Celeste and stuff who came in were like there were a couple of points where they there were a couple of points where they just went. I have to leave. Like it's too yeah. much. Like it's it's so and midway like, through the final, which is gonna be on camera going up on my channel. Uh, a dude just screams in my ear. <laughs> like sure, I'm playing with Luke, a guy just turns around and yells, so he he was sitting at table behind me, he must like win his game, like, no he doesn't even win his game, he does like some dumbass fucking combo, like I impermed you and activated Mystic Mind, ha! and then like turns to yell it to someone else and just screams right here, and I was like I won't lie, you are so I do, fucking ignorant it did happen, it did like twice or three times I heard everyone explode and I was like, oh, that's cool, except for the fact that there's like 15 other people here trying to do stuff yeah. I don't, don't get me wrong be excited about what you're doing but bro I completely understand wanting to leave that room uh, if I yeah. wasn't in my if playing a final right then and there I would have just gotten up and left I, I will say at the very least the Wollongong players seemed fine I was like hey I appreciate there's only like 6 of them but at the very least the Wollongong players were like um, a couple of them were helping run stuff and they were very much like alright Given that those um, players, if, that, if we only had six of those people from Wollongong, I'm quite happy to talk shit about Final like Fantasy players. Yeah, fuck them. Fuck yeah. Um, but Continue. yeah, Sunday was not amazing. Like my hands were crap. Um, but then tonight, hopeful that the uh, structure decks were going to arrive. They didn't. I had everything ready in the car. Um, so Man I had was late to play because he had to get his ad libitums. Yeah, I had, <laughs> I had to find my ad libitum, and yeah, what was ended up being slightly late for work. It's like Part of the combat is fine. You don't fancy, need to know. Fancy um, um, and then, yeah, tonight, um, ended up winning. Um, just hands were good. I had the right interruptions at the right time and the right anti-interruption at the right time. In the second last round, oh, the last round, last round, I played down and lost, so Jake didn't have to then take on Paleo. Big. Yeah. Big. It was ha- I was very happy about that. I'm not playing Cat Shark to out the towers. Cat Shark out the towers? It outs their towers. I... What does it do? It doubles the water monster's attack and defense. Oh, that's pretty funny. <laughs> Double totally awesome. Speaking of, can I one. acquire one, please? What? I need a cat shark. Oh, yeah, I should, <laughs> Good I should have several. 
Thank you. Um, no, I ask you. It, it only has have... one print. Why don't I? Why yeah, do I know? Of which I bought a lot. Why do I know that you have catch up? Because I told you last week I have lots. No, of no, 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 no. The, but the reason you are the only person last <laughs> week I asked, I said, Jake. Can I borrow a catch up? Maybe it's because I see water decks and I still think of you. <laughs> no, really no. annoyingly. No, no. Yes. <laughs> um, but yeah, end of the movie tonight. Um, the one. So, first match was against Cyber Dragon, which is like hugely problematic because my towers goes there and Cyber Dragon just goes, Is that an extra monster zone you're using? <laughs> Um, but thankfully... Do you I mean how extra monsters are? <laughs> thankfully I didn't have to play into it because, um, I think he ashed the thing Who that searched the field spell. And I was like, uh, tactics, look at your hand. Because I was like, I've got full combo, I don't really need to add more cards. And I saw Cyber Dragons, I was like, oh, 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 reverse, reverse! <laughs> <laughs> and who was playing Cyber Dragons? Jesse. Uh, who else? Okay. <laughs> uh, game two was against, uh, Luke, um, Towers be Towering. Um, Sword Soul, Sword Soul, rather, really doesn't have a lot of outs to towers. Um, like, the best they can do, or the best they used to be able to do was get the, uh, level 10, and then have a bunch of ship vanish, but now that Desires is at 1, they just, it's, just it's not something to rely happens. on. Yeah. Um, and then game 3 was against, uh, Despia, because Luke ordered his stuff online. I mean, not Luke. Lewis, Lewis ordered his stuff online, so That's he had funny. the entire deck. So express yeah. posted from Nikijo, so that already got delivered. Hell yeah. So he was yeah. the only one at Locals that actually has it. Um, they also struggle to out towers. I know about 30% of what they do, um, and from what I can tell, I'm just going to summon a Barra statue. Yeah, yeah. solid strat. Yeah. Does the thing. I am going to be summoning that idiot statue until I get to play frogs. How fun for everybody. Um, yeah, like the only combo he could work out was like if he got um, Guardian Chimera and Ad Libitum on the board, he could make the Ad Libitum, um, yeah, get the Ad Libitum to add, um, like, I think it's like 1200 attack to the Chimera to make a 44. Yeah. But he just couldn't get all the pieces there. Okay. And then at one point he forgot how um, Brave worked because he's playing the Brave engine, yep. and he went to like normal summon the Luba oh, and use the effect. He's yeah. and I'm like, mm, no, fam. Mm. Um, sorry, does that it, does it say um you can't you can still normal summon right? Yeah, you, you can, can normal just, summon, but you will not have any no effects. Yeah, cool. So yeah, um, and then yeah, pull no ultis, which is just the way it goes. Uh, so only ultis pulled was Myra on a Zeus. No, uh, Lewis also Lewis pulled, pulled, it. pulled <laughs> the Ecclesia. So if I'd lost that match, it would have been hundred bucks up. Yep, good. Um, finally, oh, wait, no, it wouldn't have because then it would have gone to another round, and then possibly I would have lost. And no, 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 because I lost. Oh yeah, no. Also, yeah. Myra got her packs the pack before me and chose to get a second pack, and then the second pack was the fucking Zeus, and I was like. Um, That's alright, these ultis are shit, you don't want I them. I won't lie to you, yeah, it funnily is enough, I gave her, like, I literally just gave her a Zeus on Saturday. I was like, oh, here you go. Because I upgraded mine. So I was like, here you go. She was like, thank you. And now, oh, you big upgrades. Ultra. That's fine. No, my mother, yeah, my mother ultras are fucking illy. Yeah, I've got ultis now, it's fine, because I noticed that um, Thingy plays a Zeus engine, so I thought I'd pick some up. Splat? Yeah. It's like the one level two, the rank two you're not making. The Cavalier? No, but it's like the not the one rank two you're not making because you go up into it. Yeah, yeah. Typically, you're locked out of it. Yes. Yeah. Again, similar to birds. It's there. Yeah. It's <clears throat> it's one. Of, it's exactly like birds where you need to start your turn. Xyz attack. <laughs> yeah. Like, don't do other fancy things to try and combo. You just go Xyz attack, make Zeus clear. But that. Yeah. I still fucking hate that card. Zeus? Yeah. I totally agree. Every single... Uh, it, it happened to me not too long ago, where I think it was... Maybe Luke was playing Zoo or something. Um, and I did all my stuff, he like out it, and then he went... Make a Borbo attack directly, and I went... Ew. It's about to happen, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> yeah, this, huh? I forgot about this. But yeah, yeah. not fun. It'll, it'll, it will exist. It's still... It's so good. It will just exist forever. So I had an extended discussion with Tyler today. Um, Why? Are you coming to work? We'll talk to you your stuff. Oh, okay, cool. How deeply In unfortunate for you. <laughs> two weeks, okay. there is, like, a lot of product coming out. Yes. And yeah. Like, yes, there day. is. Because mm -hmm. uh -huh. we're going through the release schedule. It and I was all got like, pushed. Oh, fuck. There's, yeah. like, three things coming out on the 19th. Granted, Assuming they actually come yeah, out. <laughs> we live in Australia. So, like, they're coming out on, like, the 18th of May? Yep. No, that was... that. My joke misfired. I didn't say June. No, no, 18th of May. They're, yeah. 
Three weeks, three weeks. Yeah, you're right. You're we right. don't know what punchline he was going the for. The original release date's the 19th of May. I said an oh. early date instead of a dramatically later date. Yeah. Anywho, um, before we get on to some product news, uh, we have some Master Duel updates, um, of which I mean an update. Um, they have listened yet again, and they have added a new ranking. We now oh. have Diamond. Hell yeah. What's higher, Diamond or Platinum? Diamond, diamond always. In every ranked game ever. Okay. So, yeah, there's now a grind to Diamond. If I was to offer you a Diamond or a Platinum, which would you take? Diamond. Platinum. Thing is, Same platinum size. is a lot more available than what you think it is. Diamonds are artificially not. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's true. <laughs> Literally, man, man made to not be. Um, yeah, literally hordes of diamonds, and they go like, mm, rare. Mm, mm, don't look mm, in there. Don't, shh, shh. Um, so I think I saw you get like a hundred gems or something per. Yeah, yeah, which has always been the case. Um, it, from what my recent duels have been, they seem to have upped the amount of gems you get in regular play as well. Cool. We like that. Yeah, it's nice. Um, um, and the season just reset as well, so you have some grinding to do. Maybe they can update the regular you say amount I have of cards they have. To do. I didn't play last season. I, did. I saw you play last season. You streamed it. Was that last season? Yep. Yeah. Was that season before? Yep. No, it was last season. Oh, okay, I probably should go in the plat one again. I've just hit a point now where it's like, I can just resolve if he came win matches, so what's the fucking point of me playing? Play something else! No, no. it's not about playing something Dragon else. Dragon Maze is in there, and the you fact. should have all the gems you no, need no, to no, play no, the deck. No, no, I actually don't. But uh, it, Dragon Maze is really Yeah, we, we had expensive. this discussion. If for some reason, it's just like super like, expensive. Every card in the extra deck is an SR or UR. 95% of the main deck is UR. See, I could afford it. Uh... But, I play the game. Yeah, see, here's the problem. Of, okay. well, I could just play FTK and just win. But I just don't want to. This is, but is it I, because I know I'm going to win. No. no. I know I'm going to win. So there is no point in playing the game. But this is the problem. This is specifically the problem I have with this game. If Give the reason to get to the top of the ladder. If, if, if they offer him something really cool up the top end of the ladder, yeah. you then grind to the top end of the ladder. Yeah. Well, have you got to the end of your battle pass? No, I got like halfway through. See? You still had that battle pass. But the other thing about the battle pass is battle pass is only time related, not being good. Yeah, I got 90 days to do the battle pass. If I fuck around for a day every month, I'll get it. Yeah, it's, it's just like. It's not 90 days, it's 60. I oh, know, I've got 60 less days. 30, but yep. That's the <laughs> You suck at maths. No, I said it and I was like, one of you better catch me. <laughs> yeah, you're like, fuck. Um, but that, that's my thing. And, and when I saw Dying, I, I, I don't get me wrong, great. I, I like the, the, you get more rewards, you have higher to go. But again, put something there that like, literally all you need to do is say, here's some cool card sleeves that you can only get up here. People will do it. It's not well, hard. Well, in it's, theory it's, then, it's like with Diamond, hard. there's at least the, um, like, Icon yeah. frame. Yeah, I have that. Not for diamond, you don't. Oh, did you get that? Okay. That's oh, one. I have a reason to play. <laughs> I need a diamond frame to go around my master diamond. Yep. You do. There you go. Grind to diamond. Yeah. Once. Diamond one, Gem Knight FTK deck profile. Yeah, let's go. Um, but yeah, yeah, well, if nothing else, if you want to shit on this, no, 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 I, the I like silver it. lining is that they are listening to what yes. people want, so they are gradually making improvements. There's another ban list at the end of this season. Who knows what gets changed? Who knows what gets added after that? Because if they're Even already hitting they're Fusion sure, Destiny, sure, sure, sure. more than likely DPE will come in. So it depends on how much stuff they want to bring in from that era. Whether they go the full Sword Soul Flunderies, I think based everything. on what they're doing, you have to. Because they essentially the last thing they put in was synchro, whatever it's called. Maybe one synchro, yeah. No, one they sy they sorry. put in like the speed sorry. words and shit. Sorry, they sorry, put in sorry. that whole pack. one synchro that mattered. <laughs> yes, uh, yeah. but I know. But I think like if as long as they 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 keep going with this. As I said, also what is good is that naturally you'll have better decks and better players in diamond. So to test decks and like you'll have higher quality games in diamond. Hopefully, um, it's just naturally what happens because shitters can't really be bothered to oh, play a certain rank. I know what I do. I wait until the ban list goes no effect. Because yeah. then the one deck that beats my deck is no longer the fun. <laughs> For which. How does it beat your deck if all you, you do is, is it, go first no, and kill them? No, here's the thing. Is that they win the die roll and set a bunch of macro. And then you're like, Ugh. You can play through one or two hand traps like it's no problem, but five macro is a problem. Normal summon deck. But then how am I going to normal summon 
any of my cards to get in my link to does my full combo. The same way that you plan to resolve your Flunderies combo before they got decent cards. Double summon. <laughs> Double summon. <laughs> I'll consider Also, it. just open Brilliant Fusion. Don't be shit. True. I miss Brilliant Fusion. Fusion so much. I miss it so much. We get Fusion Destiny, Red Eyes Fusion, to summon all these stupid fusions. I just want to summon Seraph Knight. Fuck Leave, off. Leaves off Brand of Fusion. No, but that's not here yet. I don't have to... It's like, see no evil, hear no evil. Send snow. Yeah. To summon Seraph it, it does send snow. It sends snow tonight. Yeah. Yeah. It does, doesn't, <laughs> doesn't send snow to summon a double summon. To the yeah. double summon. No, it summons a good thing. Well, actually, no. It summons a thing double. to summon a summon good, good thing. Yeah, yeah. Guardian Chimera Simulator 2022. I'm looking so forward to summoning that card. The card's $95 now. It's huh, so it? expensive. Okay, well, I gave it to Brag for a very good... Well, I promised him a very good price, so I will stick there. Good boy. Do that for your friends. Stop being grubby and fucking charging your friends full price. Yeah, don't be shit. Uh, now, we have news... Well, actually, not that much news, because not that much has been released about it, but we have uh, the results of YCS Guadalajara. Guadalajara! <laughs> oh, stosh bosh. Oh, stosh bosh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, so the winner was... What's his name? Language. Um, Andre Toros. Um, so apparently Meaning this is... Fourth big up! YCS. Big up! Four fourth Andre. YCS. However, in his picture, he's holding up five fingers, and I wonder if everyone who's reporting that he won four YCSs is missing a YCS in there. Or and no, he did win a UDS. Maybe he's counting that. Sure. Why not? Yeah. Count it. That's five Go wins. off, King. And yeah, can confirm the prize card is still the um, five... Fucking shut up. ...link dragon piece of shit. Is there two... There's two link. What if they just never bring us another prize card? Hey yo, um, and that would be fine because like this is the thing that I've always said about prize cards: make them useless. Yeah. yeah no. D but, um. Question. On the auction page, there was a link that was a match winner. Is that a thing? Match winner. No, yeah, no it was so a match winner. That's a world prize card. And okay. They're not legal for use in a duel. No, 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 I know all the match winners aren't legal, but, but yeah, Jake, we have this he, thing with match winners where like they would be really cool to have as prices, like as collection. Yeah. I didn't several, know they printed one. There's several. Are they all for from worlds? Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Match winners so they are, are cards. So yeah. they are actually still doing match winners. That's yeah. kind of cool. Yeah. They still say not legal for using it. I, I would still yeah. like to just grab some because they they are very um, cool. Um, they do get reprints in Japanese. We don't get reprints of them here. The only ones that we got were the Blue Eyes Stop and the Dark it. Magician. Yes, the uh, Dark Magician yeah. of Legendary, Legendary Dragon of yeah. Blue yeah. Eyes and the other one. Uh, in World Superstars. Um, but yeah, I've got um, replicas of two of the match winners from um, OCG. Okay. I've got the Spellcaster one I like and the uh, Machine one, the like Galileo ship or whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, Leonardo's spaceship. Yeah, because uh, I like sky normally they're quite cool art. They're like cool collector pieces. They're I like, like I like it a lot. Twenty bucks, sad. Like you can get a PSA nine Leonardo's for like sixty dollars. This is the OCG replica you're talking about, yeah? Yeah, yeah. yeah. The OCG I'll, reprint. I'm, I want to just. We will get one eventually at some point. I'll pick one. Um, but in terms of the deck breakdown, in the top thirty-two we have nine Despiar. Four prank kid. Um, I'm assuming some component of those have brave in it. Am I stupid? All Why did you just say nine? Brave? What Can did you I read? Say nine? No, I can't. This is five. I did this last time I read our fucking YCS <laughs> top things as well. Top sixteen, not top thirty-two. Do I have top thirty-two? <coughs> no, I don't have top thirty-two. Sorry, <laughs> sixteen. Maybe that's why I read nine. Maybe I was just inserting numbers. Uh, so five Despia, four Prank Kids, three Sword Soul, a Tribrigade, a Cybus Eldritch, a Dragon Link, and a Salaman Great. That was Josh. Yeah, maybe that's why we didn't say Josh. Yeah, maybe the that's why Josh did ah, 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 was in Guadalajara. Ah, ah, ah. I um, would have noticed him there. He would have been the whitest person in Mexico. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> Very true. Um, question. Prank kids with Brave? Do we know? Or is that just... You could you only just assume, assume so. You just assume. I, I was if, assuming it, but it would be really fucking interesting if it wasn't. If it wasn't, that Keep means a fucking god. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> uh, and then when we get down to top eight, we have uh, four Despiar, two Prank Kid. Actually, no, this would be top eight. So, did I say top That's eight? That's what you just said. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you Jake, right? are you is okay, right? brother? Right? I'm really is tired. <laughs> So, four Despia, two Prank, one Cyber Cell Lich, and one Sword Soul. Um, and then, yeah, with our winner ending up being the uh, Despia, without Brave, which that's, is the that's second really YCS in a, row, in a row that has not used the Brave package. Jake just wants to push his... It's not as good. Anti, anti brave agenda. It's it's not, I, I agree good. with him, though. It's um, just not... I won't lie to you. Um, oh, no. that, that's not a bad conversion from 16 to 
I can't Top guard. normal summon my Aluba in the main phase and get trolled. Oh, no. You don't have to. You did just do thingy in standby phase. You not just get Look, trolled if you guess, add the Griffin. No, it's him. draw phase. But guess what? If you've done that, the Brave Engine's live. I also don't think it's that good, if I'm honest. Not worth. It's one again. Um, it's one again to draw legs and bricks. Total players were um, uh, twelve hundred forty three and eleven that's rounds at Swiss. Lot. That's that's a lot for a Central American YCS. It, it is, is quite a bit. Yeah. Um, I'm just seeing if there's any other. We uh, honest uh, to God, it was very like rare to get over a thousand players if it wasn't us or like. Utrecht. Yes, yes. Utrecht's always been a big one. Um, Utrecht was a, is it Utrecht big or is it? No, no, U no. Utrecht had um, uh, had eleven hundred right before COVID. No, no. One of them, I think, I swear it was the last Utrecht had like eighteen hundred. Uh, they oh, had to do it I, in two venues. Yes, yes. Because was that the one with the um, no. gold sock mat? The the, the big no. like. I just read something very interesting. Uh, so Chris LeBlanc uh, finished first in Swiss and top four overall with Adventure Prank Kids. Reportedly was playing both the Souls package, which I think is a new addition to Yeah, it's, um, it's just prank kind kids. of almost basty. But more interestingly, I uh, was also playing Ten Year Spirit Adhara because uh, it's an extender which gives access to Verte, Hulk, Selene, and Naturia Beast. <laughs> yeah. That is fucking bonkers. Yeah. Like... Oh, it's I, funny that it's taken this long for someone to go, hey, hang on. Roxy's You're... is a level four. Yeah. That's so good. That's actually great. I, if I can summon it. People if, that you have never this. played Prank Kids before don't know that this exists. But if you can summon a Turia Beast, you just should. Yeah. Like, you just should. Yeah. yeah, I think like most decks that can ever summon just Nat Beast it. just end up being Nat Beast Turbo decks. <laughs> just do it. Like, in honest to, like, honest to God, it might be the most relevant card from the long, longest time ago. It's a good card. Yeah. Very good card, but like normally getting the tutor and, and an earth is like kind of annoying. But when that you, was when the you bad acted thing. like that, Jake. I thought you were going to tell us that he was cheating and got DQ from the event in top thirty two. No, no, but I uh, was um, like drama. The yeah, that's interesting. On but like the souls souls engine is more like uh, yeah for based in general. <laughs> um, despite him not being in the room, Dra Bragg has decided to object from the other side of this wall, <laughs> literally. Has said the word objection. <laughs> objection, and that is all. Uh, this is objection. Objection. It's been a thing. I swear. Yeah. I've so, literally where, only I've heard never, about it. I've yet. never seen it either. Yeah. I've not seen a single prank. Even watching stream, I've not seen even a single prank this, player summon a jury beast. Even in this Reddit thing, it sounded as if it was an amazing revelation, and you was just like, yeah, yeah. It's it's a level one. I'm I, listen. I'm not saying it's, it's crazy that you guard. can do it. Yeah. I'm sure people knew you could do it, but. Yeah. I haven't seen anybody do it. You used so. to play this in like old like Adamantipated builds and shit. I mean, sure. You used to do the, literally the exact same thing. Fair. In Adamantipated prank kid, you just play the one at Haro. It's busted. Because you play the Roxies because it's a general just kind of starter slash extender anyway. Mm. Of like Roxies into the level 2 or the level whichever one you wanted to play and then you'd switch back to the Roxies and then you have your Haro to start with and all of a sudden the Roxies. Yes. It's always been a thing. That's cool. If like Roxies is your like kind of way you go it yeah Man. i just like summoning material beast shit's cool shout out to you know what i uh back at abc's brilliant fusion send the garnet and shit and then you make uh lavarval uh emerald summon back the garnet have glow up bulb material beast just have glow up bulb it was it was so convoluted but you play one glow up bulb a uh, lavarval uh sorry one glow up bulb and foolish barrel so you play two copies in a whole deck but it happened and it was funny Plus, Brilliant Fusion was just good, so... It certainly was. You don't open up Glot Bob, you just fucking Brilliant Fusion, and then you keep going. Make Durandale with, um... Durandale? 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 Yes. yes. Uh, with the... Oh, five. You could also, um... Yeah, don't worry. Anywho. Yeah. Uh, product news. This week, at some point, we should be getting our structured decks. Um, yep. as Ben said, some people have them, some people don't. Soon, we will all be on a level playing field. Oh, as to, some not, like to not say. To, to circle back. Uh, some parts of Australia have it, some parts don't. Weather parts don't. Because um, this will be in a different part. Of it this. does. This will be uploaded to my channel. So we haven't already covered that in this part. Yeah. Some uh, parts of Australia have it, some parts don't. Weather parts that don't. Uh, yep. 
Yes, uh, but also we are due to get Ghost from the Past, the second haunting, very soon. On Which Friday. is cool. Thursday. Uh, Thursday. I need a Thursday. cavalier now, Not so can happen. I acquire one, please? What? A cavalier. <laughs> Sky Cap- Bragg has yet again Sky objected Centuria? from the other side of the wall saying that he bets that we will still get them next week. Oh, yeah. I also yeah. Bucky Bragg, uh, we will definitely get the structure decks today, this week. I don't think we'll get Ghosts from the Past this week. Um, yeah, I think doubt. Ghosts from the Past will sell like hotcakes. Oh yeah, 100%. Um, I also, am buying a case today. Can, can, can I please acquire the XE from you? What? The reprint of the level 2. Sky Cap, I'm probably not going to buy any of Ghosts from the Past. Oh, I have no sorry. reason to. Why did I just think you said you bought a case? I'm pulling no, a I Jake. I am I'm, I'm, bro, I'm going white. Okay, anyway, it's fine. <laughs> Objection. Blake, are stupid. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, bro, um, yeah. But yeah, um, I'm looking forward to it. I already pre-ordered my uh, core for agents. So, assuming the structured decks don't arrive. Did you go with Nikita to click? I did. Enter code 015. No, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Weak. I didn't want them to sell out. <laughs> uh, also, so long term law on this channel of Jake can bitching that he's not getting structured X for his agents. Sorry, how much did you pay for your entire agent call? $13. No, $40 because I had to pay shipping. Oh, you paid express shipping? No, I just had to pay shipping. Maybe That's a lot for shipping. That's all, yeah, I was going to say, $10 yeah. you pay express. Like it three is bucks. three copies of every card, so it's like. It's gone yeah, not, they still normally just charge like three bucks. Yeah. Unless that's a new thing they're doing now, where if you order a call, you have to pay for like the proper shipping. Nah, fuck them. Mm. I think anyway, it's express. They're coming. Yeah. Well, so was that less than the sixty dollars you would have spent if they got three structures? Maybe I was going to use store credit, Ben. How would I know? I'm sorry. Maybe they came. Fucking bitch. <clears throat> anyway, moving on from that because Ben sucks. Um, <laughs> also, Dimension no. Force. Uh, no. We have. It's the new. Is the it next after, set coming out? After. No, it's the the next one. Oh, yeah, like, sorry, not the a next core main set. set. Yeah, the I mean, next core set that yeah, comes out yeah, in yeah. three weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> sorry, I was. Well, I'm, I've been so focused on the one after for so long. Like the last three it's, weeks, all we've done is go over those I, cards. When I saw the leaks for this come up, I was like, "Fuck, they're leaking the set that comes out in June." Nope. The next main set, the set is that in comes out in two, two weeks. three weeks time. <laughs> yeah. I was like, oh. Um. So we have some more cards for the TCG archetype that everybody loves. Libromancer. Sick. Literally never seen them played. Still is, it the wor- is it the most useless TCG archetype? No, 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 no. It's no. actually good. That would be War Rocks. Yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah. Back came second with War Rocks. Although I don't know if that's a real post or not because the guy's name was Tom Riddle. <laughs> oh yeah, that's some. Like... Yeah, I feel I feel like it was a fake post, but yes. Um, so we have some monsters. Um, okay. Do I only have those ones? Where are the other ones? Look, I should have other ones. The the other the other ones good. Um, ah, here we go. Okay, so. Uh, we have Libromancer Fire, uh, level 4 Cyburst Fire, 1800 attack, 1800 defense. Uh, you can reveal one ritual monster in your hand, special summon this card from your hand. If this card is special summoned, you can add one Libromancer card from your deck to your hand, except itself. You can only use each effect once per turn. So, Blake screwing his face up, like that's bad. No, uh, it's a good card. That card searches every card in the deck. Yeah, cool. So, no, like, as in, does it say Libromancer card? Card. Spell, monster, trap. So... I was completely annoying. Does it have to be summoned? Uh, yeah, yeah. when it's care. normal. You just reveal summon. a ritual. Oh no, so sorry, it's only if it's Geek special Boy summon. gets that. That reveals the same ritual that you then special summon that. You either get any other card, and you have the ritual spell to go with the ritual in hand. Uh, we'll confirm this is already um, like booked in as a secret. Um, then we have uh, Libromancer Misty Girl. Um, level 4 fairy ritual uh, you can ritual summon this card with a libromancer card if this card was ritual summoned using a monster on the field your opponent cannot target ritual monsters you control with monster effects if this card is special summoned you can target one face up monster your opponent controls until the end of this turn changes attack to 0 also negates effects okay. and these effect once per turn uh, sure. attack is 1400 defense 2100 decent card is it a quick, is that negate is it a quick effect uh, it's on summon but they have cards that summon off turn. So oh, okay. that's cool. fine. Sure. Yeah. And um, it's definitely going to be resolved from my card on field because you special summon the cards that get you the resources. So Yeah, you won't be using resources in here. Yeah. It's effectively free. Uh, then we have Libromancer Fire Burst. Hey, we have uh, these blue cards level... that aren't <laughs> You get that with ritual archetypes. No, they I tend not to yeah. like the link cards. Konami just like had this like five year period of like no blue cards that aren't links, and now they're like blue. Main deck blue. Main deck Someone blue. joked that there was a pendulum monster for this archetype. Is there? 
there is a pendulum. We'll get to that. I also have a thing for that. <laughs> okay. Um, so uh, fire burst is a level six or seven? Six. Uh, Cyburst ritual uh, attack twenty eight, defense twenty eight. Um, you can ritual summon this card with a Liberomancer card. If this card was ritual summoned using a monster or monsters on the field, it cannot be destroyed by battle. Also, any battle damage inflicted to your opponent is doubled. Uh, this card can make up to two attacks on monsters during each battle phase. Uh, when a monster declares an attack, you can banish one Liberomancer ritual monster from your graveyard. This card gains 200 attack. How that... much attack does this have? 28. Okay, that's a decent attack. That's, deep, that's a high enough attack for it to not be able to say this can cut just see an attack twice and do double damage. The attack gain seems a bit redundant. Like the, it's redundant in attack. all of them. Uh, I'm fairly sure there's like a card that triggers if a Libramancer has a higher attack value. Right. Yeah. Okay. It, sure. It's just that. Uh, and then the last one I have here is uh, Libramancer Realize. Continuous spell. You can reveal a Libramancer ritual monster in your hand. Special summon one fire token. Cyber's fire attack zero defense zero doesn't say the level. Um, some of them were obscured. Oh, w sorry. With the same level as okay. the reveal monster. Okay, makes sense. Um, when you control that token, you cannot special summon monsters except Libramancer monsters. You can only use this effect once per turn. Um, so free, free token. seems like an oak. Oh, sorry, I lied. There's way more. Um, <laughs> Libramancer bonded uh, new ritual spell. Uh, this card can be used to ritual summon any Libromancer ritual monster. You must also tribute monsters from your hand or field whose total levels equal or exceed the level of the ritual monster you ritual summon. If you ritual summon Libromancer Fire Burst with this effect using Libromancer Fire Starter on the field, it cannot be destroyed or banished by card effects. Eh. It's a... Yeah. I suppose eh. it's generic for the most part, and then if you use it, it yeah. Eh. Um, so it seems like they're building up to have Fire Starter or Fire Burst rather as like the boss monster of the yeah. deck for the moment. Um, and then finally we have Libramancer Prevented, uh, Continuous Trap. If you control a Libramancer monster, you can target one face-up monster your opponent controls. This turn, that face-up monster cannot be used as material for any Fusion, Synchro, Xe, or Link Summon. Uh, you can only use this effect of Libramancer Prevented once per turn. Once per turn during the end phase, if you control no Libramancer ritual monsters, send this card to the graveyard. That, so it, that card is just to stop you from getting cucked by Super Poly or by, like, a goddess? I suppose? Like, so you target one of the ones that's, like, unaffected, or can't be destroyed by card effect and battle and shit, and then your opponent can't No, no you can't. you can't target your own stuff. Oh, it's target the opponents? Target the opponents. Oh, okay. So it's meant to flood get your thought, opponent yeah. out of doing shit. I, that, that's much better than what I thought it was. I thought it would target your own shit and then be like, nah, you can't, you can't interact. No, 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 you can't. Oh, you, you just beat over me. You can't super poly. <laughs> you just swung over me sick. Have fun. Yeah. 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 Um, so that's it for the uh, archetypal uh, TCD exclusives. We do have a few more. It, bear with me. Um, we have Bearing. Navy Dragon Mech. Uh, level 9 Synchro Machine. Holy uh, fuck, that's a lot of cannons. It do be many cannons. Uh, so this is like a, a build on from... Uh, what's the other level 9 Synchro? Uh, uh, what's his uh, name? Let's we'll play it. Vermilion. Vermilion. Vermilion Dragon Mech. That's, that's the one. Uh, so attack 27, defense 18. Uh, generic. Uh, if this card is special summoned, you can target one face up card your opponent controls. Oh, target face up cards your opponent controls up to the number of tuners in your graveyard. Negate their effects until the end of this turn. Oh. Um, if this synchro summoned card is destroyed by a card effect and sent to the graveyard, you can target one tuner in your graveyard, add it to your hand. It's a nine. It's a nine. That's really good in virtual world. Yeah. Yeah, very solid. The other thing is, like, Vermilion Dragon Mech just needs to be sent to the graveyard to get you back the tuner, whereas this needs to specifically be destroyed, I think, what by the card effect. That it probably through. misses timing. Yep. No, no, it's an if. Oh. What? And if not a when. What did I just see? What the fuck is this thing? Ah, uh, this is the card that Ben was alluding to before. This is, uh... No more women! Stop! Uh, Patisicel Convertia. Looks like a dragon, mate. Fucking stop with the women! Uh, anyway. so this is a level 5, uh, fairy fusion pendulum effect monster. It also looks like a Medolce. <laughs> uh, scale 1, attack 17, defense 700. Uh, monster effect. If this card in the monster zone is destroyed, you can place this card into your pendulum zone. Um, its fusion material is two pendulums. Scale one. Uh, if you have no other cards in your pendulum zone, you can place one face-up pendulum monster from your extra deck in your pendulum zone. Say deck, Konami. 
You've already got to summon this card and have it popped. Just can you not just slap it on the scale? The light up is forever. Uh, well, well, yeah, by destroying it and then you using have its to effect it to put it in the scale. Oh right, it has to... no. Oh wait, yeah. So can you not just Fusion. can you not just no no scale. Yeah. That's not how that That's works. That's not how that works. Oh. Why can... Am I... What? It's a fusion. It's face down in your extra deck. You can't oh, just go... Oh, it's in my hand. <laughs> my dumbass... My, 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 my dumbass... In my brain... Here's what I was doing, right? In my brain, I'm picturing all of the Kalees, and I'm like, but you just... <laughs> <laughs> that's that, how pendulum that, works. They go there. My brain was going stealth. They, uh, they go there, right? I, literally, yeah. I was going stealth. Uh, carrier. <laughs> Helix, uh, why can't you do that? Oh, That's Jesus. trash. It's really not great. Like you have to waste so many resources to actually pull this off. You should have said like, deck. Huh? I got free scales. No, you didn't. You should have said place a scale from deck. Might as well have. Like, what's the worst thing you're going to put there? They've still gone neg three, exactly. effectively, because they've had to use a polymerization card to fuse two pendulums, which are going to the graveyard more than likely, and then gotten yeah, some mechanic. Would... Which, real pendulum is easy enough. You can pop it with almost any pendulum mechanic. To get any sort of good advantage, you've had the pendulum summon already to get those cards back. And then you have to come up with... At like which a, point, you've already got cards in your yeah, scale, so her effect point, to put herself into scale you, is redundant. You activate Sky Iris, you pop it, it gets into scale, you get another bit back, you have a second scale, you activate the thing that gives you two pendulum summons. Sick. Th oh, yeah, this that, is, this oh, is a yeah, five that's... card hand Is that out? I don't know, maybe I feel like that card's out Or it's coming in the next set Konami you've is got, very um, good Odd Eyes, Pendulum, Graph, Dragon Coming in the next set yeah. And awesome. Beyond the Pendulum as well Is in the next set Yeah Fair Electromite 2 Great It's worse I like I We did yeah, go no through Again I totally understand that we went through A whole period of like No, you know what? Pendulum we two. don't care about Pendulums anymore <laughs> Misc to one Misc to, misc to zero Um <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I, I, I understand we went through the Konami renaissance of like no more pendulum we just we're not going to do it anymore just play something else totally get it we go through these periods with a, a bunch of different um, types of cards like we just go through like you know well cycle. for ages Synchro sucked and now yeah, Synchro's just like good no. and now they want to make you kind of now like bust XC's right now I have felt like are good are okay um, but there aren't what the rank four decks. Slow, they aren't what the rank four decks. They don't immediately get access back to those material. Yeah, um, they don't. You know, they like we went through the whole rank four meta, all this stuff. Like, so, sure. okay. So here's the problem, at least with Xyz, is that they hit their peak with Zoo. Like, yeah. one card material, they summon fucking twenty of them. It, they all have that, decent that, effects. That was so, Xyz doing. Listen to what I just said. The fact that Xyz is too slow because you don't get instant access to the material. In Zoo, you got instant access to the material and everything was one card. One, 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 one. Yeah, like, but this is the, the problem that I'm getting at is that they broke Pendulum... Um, not Pendulum. Xyz yeah. with that. Yeah. And any attempt that they've gone to get back to that yeah. has it's just, just too ruined slow. the format that they're um, in. Yeah. They did the same with Pendulums, I guess. Like, Pendulum Magicians, Full Power Pendulum Magicians was so good that we just kind of went... All right, that was it. Literally, the only anymore. reason that we didn't notice pendulum how pendulum magician good... or Pepe. No, oh, pendulum magicians. I think like so. Like when we got this in that as spike, a set. in that spike yeah. of like astrograph at three oh, and fucking yeah. like so that it was ridiculous. Wasn't, it wasn't that good though. It was. No, it was so you, very consistent. It was, a good it was deck. very so consistent. But, no, no, no. Hear no. me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. The only reason yeah. we didn't notice how good Pendulum was is because Spiral was T0. No, no, no. So we had... Yes, yes. You're true. Because that YCS was it. overtaken by Spiral. We got it while Zoo was around. We yeah. lost Zoo. It was kind of good for like two weeks, but Draco was also still kind of good, so it still kind of fucked it. And then... But that wasn't full power Pendulum. We didn't have Electromite. Yeah, we yeah. didn't have Electromite. But we also didn't have Electromite during Spiral format. Yes. Wait, didn't we? Yeah, no, we, we did not. No, we didn't. We got Electromite at the end of Spiral Format. Yeah. Or no. No. Electromite was in the same set as... Double Helix? No. No, no because so... it was not at that YCS. Okay. <sighs> yeah, because yeah, it came in the next Feb set. Okay. Yeah, so that that's that's the reasoning as to that. So it's like, we had Spiral, we had that, then Spiral got hit, they gave us that, and then FTK, 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 FTK. That's all I remember for that next three months. Yeah. 
Um, so but that, but that's you know that you FTK me. Yes. Okay. Goodbye. Oh, do you know what I still think is the craziest part about that FTK in particular? If you missed it or they stopped you, you would just make a big board anyway. Yeah. It was like, yeah. oh, okay, guys, I'm just playing a yeah. really good deck like, anyway. At just... the same time, it was in fucking Gem Knight. It was, if you got stopped in your FTK, it's like, okay, um, I have a defense position block dragon. <laughs> Unless you can out this, I will kill you next time. <laughs> You're just dead. Um, um, by the way, if you outed this but didn't kill me, I've just gone plus three. I'm going to go plus three again on my turn. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> But yeah, they, they do have like the periods of time where they just decide, these are the cards we like. Fine. As long as it kind of rotates, I'm okay with that. Lynx, I thought for a long time. I was like, eh, it's been a while. Um, so it's cool to see like, again, Sword Soul pop yeah. up. Sword Soul, I, I, you know, I, as much as annoying as that a deck is, I was like, hey, cool. It's a different type of deck. That deck's fine now. It's it right. was A's when they yeah. just set up a floodgate. Yeah. And that when was they were like... like, again, blanket effects, not the game, please. Stop. What, what deck we're talking about there? I zoomed out. Sword Soul. Oh, yes. I was, was like, like, wait, not, there's, not, there's only... no floodgates in Gen yeah. Not yeah. only, <laughs> pretty much. I was, I was still on FTK brand, and I was like, what if TK played a floodgate? <laughs> you can probably see in the no, replay of no, this, my brain no, no, no. The over. floodgate that FTK plays is your life. <laughs> <Yeah>. You're dead. <laughs> you are dead. You've been floodgated out from existence. <laughs> <laughs> from round yeah. one. Uh, you'd think I topped the fucking regional with Protoss, yeah. simply just being there. You think I would remember that? Are we on to you think uh, so? We well, gonna, before yeah. we get on to questions, since we've started discussing like the formats and stuff like mm -hmm. that, we are getting pretty close to ban list season. So, Best. like, what realistically, like, not so much hopes, but what do you think is going to be addressed in this upcoming ban I list? I haven't remotely thought about this ban list. Okay, despite us mentioning it before we started. Yeah. Well, okay. you've only had the podcast, so. But I would. I was. I'll start by just saying I hope very little gets touched. No, that's we're in a weird situation where a lot can get touched yeah. but kind of nothing really needs to like also we can't really talk because we're in a country where we haven't even gotten branded yet I, so I we, will say, we look, haven't played the new format it is really early on in branded so this YCS um you know a, oh, stats like, could change branded has no reason to be but, hit you, you don't hit but, branded in the slightest but what I mean is that like I, st I still think everything if, if the current stats that we have are about where it'll be yeah everything seems strong enough that branded isn't going to be just fucking everywhere all of the it's time it's not going to be a I'm sky striker thing where it's i'm just happy for it to just be a good deck i'm all right with that what i'm more getting at is we're still we haven't seen what the format is like for us so we can't mm. really speak to what should necessarily be hit because we haven't experienced it oh i, well, I to think, an extent so actually, i think we for the for the Actually. most part, we can definitely comment on what could be hit outside of Branded. Oh, yeah. No, purely because can, Branded is far too early to hit. We can discuss this, but, like, we haven't experienced the format. That That's you, fine, but that yeah. the only part of doing that that's relevant is how decks feel to play against. Yeah. Because we know about how powerful Branded's going to yeah. be yeah. in comparison, or what its like, matchups are. When we finish the Ben point where I'm trying to get with this, is that... We're still living in a world where Scythe can be super oppressive. That's, I was, uh, yeah, Yet you've read my you mind. When you look yeah. at what happened at the YCS, yeah. it just didn't exist. I, I still like, think, I was, what I was going to, you absolutely read my like, mind because Scythe was on it. Cybers Eldritch is the deck that plays it. Yes, Cybers Eldritch finished second. Yeah. You still hit the Scythe package. You yes, still you get do. rid of Dagda. Absolutely. Or you get rid of Scythe. Just get, yes. Don't care which one, it's probably Scythe is the problem. But, yeah, don't don't hit the tag like, no, it, What are they going to do? Is, fucking moral attack pop you? Yeah, because the, the thing was, I was going to say is, um, you've absolutely killed it because like it's how that feels to play against. Yeah, sure, it might not be ninety percent of decks are setting up a scythe lock. Yeah, but it should. You just shouldn't have something in the format that says like, you are not playing, even if you open up. It, like it, it, these blanket effects that cut you out. I think just. Removing them from the current game we're in. Scythe at the time wasn't that good of a card. Again, Moral Attack was the one that got hit. Um, now we're just at a point in the game where that's not fun. It's like fun is even, not even the word. Just remove Scythe, leave yeah. Dagda. It can do some cool stuff. So blanket effects really, you feel are like the thing that should be taken it's, out. Sorry, sorry. Turn, I want blanket effects are always the problem. It's just effects that have effect. The the thing I have a problem with is effects that once they occur, if at that very moment you don't have an answer, it affects the next. Like, oh, your turn is under this lock. You are done. You, you need yeah. to be. You are done. Okay. So effectively, 
Scythe is like the most prevalent one. There are more. It, yeah, there would also be Harpy's Feather Storm. Um, See, Droll. So mm. Droll is fine because you've at least but it's fine. you've gotten a plus. Yes. If you've plussed into something you intended to get pluses with, you agree. You fuck yourself. Yes. But we're also in a time like we're not dis- no, also, we're not discussing him. But, but there are decks. But not, there are decks that summon yeah. from deck. There are decks that like Droll. Droll yeah. is a blanket effect that is I think not too strong. Yeah. See, um, but Featherstorm is a great example. Featherstorm is also like archetype locked, and yeah. it's not like Flanderese is overly dominating the meta. Uh, it does have a very good matchup against uh, fucking Prankid, kind of. Yeah. It's some kind of struggles against Prankid. I, play, I, I still think, good, I genuinely, that's matchup. why I think Shifter sh- Actually, I think Shifter should at least be moved somewhere. It Shifter doesn't, listen, the first of those three it doesn't ropes. need to. But yeah. like, if they could just not do it, but I do think that. Because of what's in the format, it's really bad. I so I think this is gonna be pretty out there. I think Meow Meow Mew gets banned. Possibly, okay. I've heard a few I, people call for that. I think Meow Meow Mew gets banned. That's pro- Prank Kids is the deck that needs to be addressed. When you take care, of, you take care of the scythe that checks and makes much more fair. The decks like Cyber Cell Ditch, Brave Phantom Knight, if that decides to show its head again. Uh, you like. don't play it in Prank Kids, so that wouldn't hit Prank Kid. You ban Meow Meow Mew. I think that's necessarily what needs to happen to kind of make that deck disappear as much as we don't want to... As much as I don't want to be like, Meow Meow Mew needs to go. It probably needs to go. It is the one hit that does severely cripple that deck. Do you... Do you so you want to severely cripple it going into this it, format? It, or do you think it's, it's had enough time? Had its time. It's sure. been around for a long time. It was getting tops before Brave. It's now dominating with Brave. It's the one deck that can fundamentally be slaughtered on this ban list. Um, can I have a double check? Did they say we're getting... Time. Did they say... Because I still... How they operate is weird. Did they say we're going to get one around this time? Or have they just uh, said... N- so they said we're just going to get most... it when we're giving it to you. Sure. This That's is the most right. vague they've been yeah. in a we are, no problem. We are ages. back in the eternal format. That's okay. So this and, and... could necessarily be a six month... Yeah, and, and eight, if they just want to let this run, um, and let, again, I, again, have no problem with people who want to keep playing decks they like, I will do the same, but that I think there are just health, like, OH&S changes that could happen, um, for the game. I did have more bands that I've now forgotten. Um, oh, hit me. Uh, so, was that? Anaconda, DP, um, that was Dragoon. Fusion Destiny. Um, <laughs> Fusion Destiny will likely go to one. Yeah, that's right. It is more than likely like it's at two now it'll go to one were you the person talking to me about like the interaction of like oh they're doing a thing you negate the thing and then they just go uh on sunday against luke uh he does standard sword soul package and i'm like activate fusion destiny he's like baron negate and i'm like activate the other fusion destiny yeah yeah Uh, yeah yeah affect target the chi shao baits the chi shao negate yep it does I I'm will a, now I'm play. A, I'm gonna now play my frog. Deck. I'm just gonna just play. The frog <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm yeah. just gonna play now. Thank you. Yeah. Um, um, yeah, that's fair. Yeah, that's. Those are probably the three necessarily huge hits. I feel as though there can be a lot in the current ban list that's gonna come off. Like that entire oh, two list is probably just fair. gonna disappear. That all showed up last ban list. Yeah, the stuff's tattoos. either gonna move up or it's gonna come down. You don't need to hit the Nadir package anymore. That's perfectly fine. So Nadir servant didn't even need to go to two in the first place. Not really. Um, Invoke's not really doing anything that all that. No, it hasn't. <laughs> yeah, it had a little bit of shine back there at the end of the it last format. A top. It got in a deer servant put the two. <laughs> it had a top. It's um, yeah, realistically, the one the... absolute piece of murder that happens on this ban list is probably prank kids. Um, so in terms of the two list, it was malicious. A hero lives. Fusion destiny got put to two. Yeah. Nadir servant. Salamin great circle and scapegoat. Yeah. Was the was all the malicious was already there, right? Malicious was already there. Sorry, malicious, malicious just, just stays there, lives by himself. Everything let him do thing. Onto it went down to two. Yep, goes to one. Yep, Everything fusion destiny that, Nadir servant. Well, Nadir can probably just go back to three. <laughs> the rest. <laughs> so fusion three. destiny, yeah, and then hero lives scapegoat circle. You want to give Solomon Great circle a three? Who gives a fuck? They it put could. it to two when it should have stayed at one anyway. Yeah, just cool. give him fucking three. Um, and then I Bang think. There are, in terms of limited cards, again, it's it's probably a whole video in itself if you want to look at cleaning up the, the ban list and like what cards are one in it, two in it, 
Zero could actually move. Yeah. Um, but that would be that I would be more interested in. Actually, we might see two Astrograph. I would I would like to see instead of hits, I would like to see Scythe go. But then I would actually like to see bring some stuff back and make the format even like open up the format a little bit more. Um, this, we're in an awkward state where a lot of stuff that's at zero just kind of needs to be at zero. Th- like, there is a lot there, but I still feel like there's some stuff that you could probably move. Correct me if I'm wrong. We did receive a Dengwon reprint. Yeah. No. no. I swear there's a Dengwon reprint. I thought that it was it's a different yeah uh, different Yang Zing. No. It was a no. It was I the. Don't think why, we for some reason Dengwon. I thought I caught wind of a Dengwon reprint. Uh, wasn't it why. um the other one? The comment below the if it is a Dengwon one? reprint. <laughs> yeah. No. The other the other Yang Zing's got one. Yeah. Yazi and I Yazi just did all of them, including Dengwon. No, they wouldn't have reprinted Dengwon. Hey, it was Morphing um, Jar at one. Yes. <laughs> in, in important and current news. <laughs> it went to one. No one cared. Yep. Quick fixes at one. Yeah, sure. They, they, I, again, there's there's stuff, but I think... Um, but yeah, this is like a very sort of ad-libbed thing. We've not obviously not thought about it very often. We'll um, be doing a more in-depth discussion when we have predictions, probably in about a week or two. Yep. Yeah, we can put some stuff together. I, I would like to see, again, more importantly, what you think will come off. Because it would just be interesting to see like what decks you think could be used could give a boost to put them at tier two. Like we probably don't need to put anything else at tier one right now. We've got again a new tier one deck coming up. We probably don't need to fuck with it, but it'll mm-hmm. be cool. Yeah. All right. Uh, so we move on to our Discord <laughs> um, and podcast. Uh, so if you weren't aware, we do have a Discord link. Will be in the description. Feel free to join. Um, Say hi, ask us questions. Uh, cool bunch of lads in there. Have a yeah. chat. Tell your friends. Uh, Tell your first mom. question. <laughs> Tell your dog. Get your dog in the Discord. <laughs> ruff, ruff. Yeah, I yeah. actually want to see dog pictures now that he's mentioned it. I, yep. want, I want dog pictures. Um, Oracle Osiris asks, "How do you think Phantom Knight? How do you think a Phantom Knight's link to Shut that up. isn't Cherubini would affect the deck's performance? What more could that deck get? Shut up. <laughs> Why? The deck's got everything." It has literally it has like anything and everything. One of the best resource, ca- like one of the best resource engines I've ever seen. It's just like shut up. It doesn't need it. No, Cherubini was interesting at least. I mean, yeah, it just effectively made it into a rank uh, level three deck. Yeah. So it was just like oh, and then Etelli got brought to three, which yep. I don't think it was their initial thing to support Phantom Knights. I think it was a legit thing of like There's mutants. The mutants and the no punk, both oh, level that three was psychics. The thing that came out. Yeah, yeah, and it just got used in based. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, you don't need anything, honestly. Stop asking for shit. There's other decks that need it. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna like say, invoked. Oh. Yes, like I invoked. don't want invoked. 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 They need a link to. They need a link to that says um, invo again. We have that. They do. That's exactly what it does. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think I've read Invoke Cards? Actually, in saying that, you know what? That's pretty cool. See? My game design knowledge isn't bad, actually. That card's existed for years. What's it called? Uh, the, Alistair uh, the Madness Alistair, Invoker. Yeah, Alistair the Invoker of Madness. Oh, the one that's... Uh, uh, it's like uh, halfway uh, between uh, itself and yes. Kaliga. Yes, and yeah, oh, yeah, I'm with you. Yeah, and you pretty much read it's effect verbatim. See? If you fusion Look at summon my game. I'm discard, telling you guys. add another invo, do it again. Yeah, I'm fucking, I'm telling you guys. I add know. another like, effect that nobody cares about. Nobody, oh yeah, you can. That was the old OTK. Because <laughs> <Shut up. laughs> you'd sorry. summon fucking Purgatrio, punch over shit, book of law, macabre, punch. Sure. Anywho, uh, next question from podcast comes from Wally Jones. Shout out, shout out Wally. Uh, what about Alabaster and Blue, Blueis? Um, I, I don't know it. if you watch the podcast, but, but I require more context. This was a comment from my channel. Yeah, I need yeah. more information from you, uh, I, Mr. I think, Wallace. Mr. It, was, Jones. it was on my video about how the thumbnail was everything went to two, because we're talking about the... Oh, so he's... He, okay, he so it's Alabaster because of your... Lewis. <laughs> Well, no. Here's the problem. Is he talking about a Luber or Alistar? <laughs> no. Uh, uh, both. Alistar to two or Luber to two. Um, Can you? Oh, they limit. They, they limit Alistar. Oh, that would shut people right. up. It would like, be so honestly. funny. Is it would it, be so is it funny. Knocked down at one in Duel Links. Two. I don't know. Master Duel. Oh, Master Duel to two. I don't okay. know what it's in Duel Links. Oh, Duel Links. Alistar's at one. I think. Yeah. <laughs> Alistair sure. too good. And that, he didn't even no, have any Alistair's good fusions. 
His invocation is also at three, so you can only play a combination of one Alistair to invo or two one invo to Alistair. Uh, and then we have uh, Mars Lowell asks, uh, or rather states, uh, the noisy aircon got a good chuckle. Uh, it's yes, been Changer. there for 20 episodes. No, it's like 17 episodes. This pretty much, so. yeah, pretty much since you started editing. <coughs> it's the noisy aircon is in every episode. Nah. Um, I miss it. I miss its noise. But I get to hear it now that it's actually gotten like not disgustingly hot, but I miss you. Yeah, now that we can open windows and doors. Yeah. Um, the, the truck from the toaster factory gets pretty loud when the doors open. <laughs> True. Um, but yes, uh, changeover can only summon dragons. If strikers weren't anime girls, I would still be playing the equivalent. It's just too splashable and good in branded. Uh, is, Opened... it? is it good in branded? I don't know if it is. I, don't know if it is. I think that's a lie. Right. Mm, don't know, don't um, well, last thing we've got is some cool shit. Well, potentially well, cool stuff. Yeah, Something really basically, anyway. uh, some early reports from the OCG are putting uh, Spli. I think that's how you pronounce it. Splite. 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 Uh, Splite. As a very, very strong contender, uh, taking out a lot of representation and tops. Um, Jake's looking miserable already having to put up with this deck. I'm the deck thinking. doesn't oh, so fusion summon uh, he's like yeah if anybody doesn't know it's like a 2-2-2 a two, two, two deck it's a rank 2 link 2 deck yeah, that like likes, does a lot of likes two, things and then twos. plays frogs uh, it summons treat toad it then summons, summons totally it, but... shut the fuck awesome. up um uh, it summons that can I have my thank you um <laughs> it, it summons it back again off turn it's a cool deck um it runs 15 to 16 it, hand traps also because floodgates your opponent <laughs> it floodgates your opponent but off on your own turn correct no it just floodgates the opponent it, I, it's yep. only for your turn though right then there's a turn you activate the effect yeah, yeah. it's a quick effect no i think it's a quick effect then i'm fairly certain after oh okay there might be a way to quick rank yeah. but i'm pretty i know it's from what I've read, it's just your turn. But if I'm you can quick rank really it, sure then yes, the you can lock your two opponent. summons one back from Grave, and then you Xyz. Oh no! But like it, the link two can be used as the Xyz. Oh no! So I think that's what you, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think that's what you do. I think you go the link two brings back totally awesome. Then you make the Xyz and flood your opponent. And then you have the totally awesome to just yeah, so or well, something does something yeah. it, like it hard flood. But it's very different formats of what yeah, they do there yeah. and what we do here. It's so I deck, don't get me wrong; I don't think that this will be a bad deck by any means. But I just think that there's the key differences between OCG and TCG that I think will make this probably not as strong as it has been there. It may just be a popularity thing too. It's like their, like between their branded engine and their brave engine they've been crippled somewhat and then this has come out full power it plays cards that people like because people love a fucking toad well the thing is so the, the thing is what's interesting is and i've been really trying to think of examples of it happening here and i'm sure there are some i just it's just escaping me it also might be the case of very good deck will be great here 70 percent representation or fit or 55 70 percent representation played and then 50 something percent representation in top um, off top, rather, it might not be that good because every other deck in the format has been hit or nerfed so, or killed. There's Jake, you, you raised a good point of it's kind of works differently in the OCG as to what it does here. As we saw from the way we played stuff like Sword Soul, um, in the OCG they play to not lose, so they will play hard control. I just want to stay alive in the game and continue to grind out. Mm -hmm. Is that because also best of one? Uh, no, it's best, it's best of three. Their YCS is a best of one. But, okay, because um, I understand playing that heavy control if it is best yeah. of one. You're just like, I'm not losing this game. When we get this deck here, we will see people playing 40 card lists, 35 cards will say, uh, 25 cards will say summon a level two. The other 15 cards will be hand traps. Yeah. And um, we will just see people go like, summon level two, summon level two, flood it, flood it, flood it, flood it, summon level two, summon level two, and just keep playing. You get hand trapped, I've got another card that says summon a level two. Just the way we play all of our shit here is I'm just going to throw everything I possibly can at the board and make this shit as oppressive as possible. Mm. I noticed in a lot of the... I'd, I need to double check what the archetype specific monsters do. Yeah. But a lot of um, oh, the 
three OCG lists I saw. I'm um, fairly sure all their very, main like... deck monsters just say summon another one. Okay, because it has been very like um, fifteen to sixteen hand traps, call buys, cross outs, so you can or cross out um, in the OCG. I think they have Be- their archetypal spells. And yes, stuff. because you play, you can play all the hand traps. Yeah. You just play cross out. Um, they, I'm they... looking for three cross out if anybody has anyway um, I don't know I had two anyway it's fine um, looking for three cross out um, because you can play all the hand traps it has a way to out all of the hand traps which yeah. is really cool and then you just stop your opponent and just fucking go yeah. um, but you are very right we are very aggression based here in like how we want to demand our board be set up yeah. we'll, we go. will see a lot of decks simply cut the hand traps and then just be like more consistent here's more cards. cards that say level 2 on board yes like over there we're seeing like evil twin variant and then we see the water variant I think we'll just see Fuck water variant twin. with more cards like you say that Fuck there is twin. a very realistic chance though that we don't even play swap frog in our engine oi don't talk like that like it's it very much a chance that we just don't play the swaps and the dupes and the toads and we just, just play like- other cards that say summon a level 2. That's fair. Just to circle back a little bit, I don't know whether you've seen or heard, but Evil Twin prices are going even higher than they already were for what was a yes. fucking terrible deck. Yes. Because, but I want again, to summon treat them. anime women. Um, but anyway, it'll be interesting sword. to see what impact that actually has on the game and how our ban list between now and when it's released will actually impact its Realistic, impact. realistically also, we have one right don't now that we're probably wrapping this up don't believe all of this hype uh don't, yeah, because yeah, yeah, yeah. for yeah, example yeah. uh loza posted in our group chat tonight a uh, chart that was like 75 percent splite eight percent this uh that that was a chart from our locals <laughs> yeah yeah so, don't <laughs> just be, yeah just because yeah. you see data online don't then go pay fucking yeah. Eighty dollars for cards that are forty dollars. Unless it's on oh. Road of the King, I would just move past it. Yeah, because it's odds on just a chart from some fucking locals. Yeah, um, yeah, but I think that will pretty much conclude us for tonight. If you do have any questions, like I said, jump in the Discord, ask us. Um, otherwise, yeah, we'll see you guys next week. Sell me a cross out. <laughs> do it. <laughs>